You're waiting for a new tablet and two turn up at once. Typical. First up, Apple, announcing the latest version of its iPad. Senior Vice President Phil Schiller, a man on a mission. Today we think we have the biggest step yet in delivering the vision that is iPad. I would really love to show it to you right now. Thinner, lighter, more powerful than ever before, and incredibly, excitingly new in so many ways that it deserves a new name. The audience enjoy the new look, but it's the name that really gets the attention. Dramatically thinner, just 7.5 millimeters thin. The new iPad Air weighs just one pound. First of November is the date you need to remember. And so we move from California to Abu Dhabi, and the company that almost collapsed after failing to innovate when the iPhone first arrived. Nokia finally dipping its toes in the tablet market. Executive Vice President Stephen Ellop making the introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, the Lumia 2520. Isn't that great? Analysts say the tablet, along with Nokia's new Lumia smartphones with six-inch screens, are priced low enough to attract interest, but question whether they can compete with similar products being launched in time for Christmas. With Microsoft expected to wrap up its takeover of Nokia early next year, and having just launched its own Surface tablets, the future is unclear for Nokia's Lumia offering.